Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Coach Adrian. I am an expert in helping people get back with the one they love. I help people from all over the world, from all walks of life. My passion is in building healthy, sustainable relationships. And today I wanted to talk about how it is possible for people to get back together when they still live together. It is a topic that comes at least once a day. I have people that are broken up but still have a lease together or still share a property together and uh, people have a very difficult time in figuring out how to apply some of the techniques uh, that we that we chat that we discuss about on our on our website. How to do a no contact if you see someone every day or is it relevant to write a letter to someone if you sleep in the same bed, for instance. And so I wanted to do a video to kind of give you a few pointers and so that you don't feel like you're completely overwhelmed uh, having to deal with the person you love on a daily basis and not being together. So being together under the same roof is not a weakness. It's not something that plays against you in this process as long as you are following a clear plan something that makes sense, something that ha you have developed, okay? You can use it to your advantage. You can leverage this opportunity, this platform, to trigger certain reactions, to showcase your change, and to prove to your ex that you don't have to be at odds. So as a whole, I would rather um, have you be in a situation where you have to deal with your ex every day rather than in a situation where you can't see your ex at all. Because seeing an ex is a necessary step along the process of trying to get back together. This is something that you already can benefit from, so good for you. Ultimately, the hardest part of living with an ex is making sure that we are not too needy. Making sure that we don't let our insecurities get the best of us and not crowd their space. You have to, you have you basically have to evolve overnight if you really want to have an impact. You really need to quite quickly understand what went wrong and start to implement those changes right away. While at the same time, giving your partner space within the living space so that um, you don't ultimately uh, are not overbearing and so that you can heal. You can heal throughout the day while pursuing relevant goals by staying busy, by pushing, by stretching your comfort zone. And then once you come home, you have to be on your best behavior. You really have to put your best foot forward, be positive and try to be as inspiring as you can without overdoing it. Living with an ex is positive. If, like I said, you are prepared to do the work, if you are ready to take control of your emotions and to act the way that you're supposed to. I know it's not easy. That's why I've created an audio seminar on how to get back with the next if you still live together. It's actually not an audio seminar, it's a video seminar, a video series of almost 19 videos to tell you exactly what you need to do from A to Z to turn things around. And I urge you to go on my website at withmyexagain.com and to check it out. It's helped a lot of people before you and I think that it will help you too. It's basically a compilation of all my success stories that I've tried to put together in this one product. Ultimately, though, whether you're living together or not, a few ingredients are necessary to turn things around. You need to be honest with yourself, you need to have a plan, you need to take action, and you need to control your emotions. More than ever if you still live under the same roof. And I'm excited for you because you have to stop fighting and resisting what has happened and focus on the future. If you do so, if you stop trying to fight your ex over their decision to break up, and if you focus on you and what you hope to achieve and to, and, and to, and, and to aspire to, and if you don't focus on the potential move out date and why your ex is moving out of the bedroom or why they're acting like this or why they're acting like that, if you can tune out the noise and focus on you, good things will happen quickly. From my experience, people that do the work and live together, end up getting back together more quickly if you have a clear plan. And that's why I urge you to reach out to me, to book a coaching session if you don't know what to do. 
if you want to go above and beyond my video seminar, if you want to go above and beyond my YouTube channel, my blog articles, etc., reach out to me. It's my passion. It's what I love to do day in and day out. And as long as you're ready to do the work, because it's not just going to happen overnight, as long as you're committed, as long as you're fighting for the right reasons, you can count on me. So I wish you all the very best. Stay focused and see you soon. Hopefully you can reach out to me quickly so that we can work together. Take care.